Let's see what an arch looks like. That's kind of fun. So you can do all of that. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it on medium. Hello creators, I'm Ben Tolson from Podia and I wanted to quickly share some exciting updates we've made to the Podia site editor. You can now edit the corner style and width for most images and videos and you can set your images aspect ratio for most sections, including your logo. To show you how it works, I'll take you through examples of each new style on a fake website I built in Podia. I am now in the site editor for Song Study. It's a website I made up for a songwriting course. It doesn't exist, it's not real, but I have all of the basic elements on the homepage that you might see on a homepage. So I'm gonna go through, and as I'm looking through, I see a lot of things that are kind of off with the images. The first thing being the logo. So we're gonna start here, I'm gonna edit this section. And once the sidebar pops up, you can click on design. And here you have your new image style options. So there's aspect ratio, corners, and width. I don't need to mess with the aspect ratio or the corners on this one since it's an image against white and it doesn't have a clear border. So I do want to make it bigger though. So right now the default is 20% and that's quite small on my screen. So I'm gonna bump that up and go ahead and make it 40. I think I like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and close that out. This looks okay to me. I, I think I might wanna make the image just a little bit smaller though. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this section and I'll do the same thing. I'll go here to design and I'm gonna leave the aspect ratio and the corners the same, but I'm gonna bring this down to 40. And I think I like that. It's a little bit bigger than the logo, but it doesn't take up quite as much horizontal space. So I'm gonna close that out. So it's not just images. Again, we can also do videos. So I'm here in a video section. I'm gonna go ahead and click on this and I wanna make this the full width. Now with videos, you see you don't have the aspect ratio option because the video loads in its native aspect ratio, but we can still, we can change the corners. So I can change it to a hard edge corner. I can change it to small, medium, or large, and I can even make it round. And if this was a square video, this would actually be a circle. Let's see what an arch looks like. It's kind of fun. So you can do all of that. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it on medium, and I'm gonna increase the width. That looks good. So I'm gonna close that out. Continuing down, I have these selling sections and I wanna make them more uniform. So all of these images are from Unsplash and the images from Unsplash all have different aspect ratios, different dimensions. So I wanna make these more uniform. I'm gonna go ahead and click on this one and I'm gonna go here to design and I wanna set the aspect ratio to square. I like that. I'm gonna leave the corners as they are and I wanna leave the width at 50%, although I can take that all the way to 100% and make it big, I can make it much smaller, but I'm gonna leave it at 50%. And I'm gonna do the same thing to each one of these. Make it square. That looks good. And this one. All right, so now these are all square and uniform, that looks great. Now to the next section, this is a testimonial section. And you can see these pictures are pretty small. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on this again. And first I'm gonna adjust the size. I'll bump that up so you can actually see the faces of the people. Now we could go here and we could, right now it's set to rounded corners. We could change these corners up a little bit if we wanted to. I'm gonna go ahead and keep the round. We could also change up the aspect ratio if we wanted to. That's kind of fun, but I'm gonna go ahead and leave it square so that they're round. I like that. All right, and then here is a short bio. And I think what I don't like about this is that the text takes up quite a bit more vertical space. The image just doesn't sit well in the space. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on it. And I wanna make the width a little bit smaller so that the text is a little bit wider and doesn't take up quite as much vertical space. But then I'm also going to set the aspect ratio to square. That's gonna zoom in on my face a little bit and I'm gonna go ahead and set the corners to round and that feels a little bit more balanced. So I'm gonna go ahead and leave that as is, close this out. And then I've got two more sections here that I wanna mess with, I think, yeah. So this first one, the songwriting credits, these are all real, I'm just kidding. But this is, this is kind of small, so I wanna bump the size up on that one and bring the width up 
so that you can see those logos nice and big. That looks about right. And then the very last thing I'm gonna do here is I don't like how this is so big and then this feels kind of crunched off to the right over here. So I'm gonna click on this and I'm gonna bring the width down on the image and now that just feels a lot better on the page. All right, and so that's it. I've made just a few minor adjustments to the images, but I feel like as I'm looking through this, it just looks a lot better. It looks a lot closer to what I had originally envisioned for the layout and the structure of this page. And there you have it. These updates are live right now on your Podia site, so go check them out for yourself. And if you have any questions or need help, don't hesitate to reach out to our support team.